Mr. Ian Duncan Smith. No. Mr. Speaker, can I say to my right honourable friend that I, of course, appreciate enormously uh, the huge endeavours she has made to deal with what has now emerged as a particularly toxic issue, that of the Northern Irish backstop now bound into the withdrawal agreement. I do say to my right honourable friend, for all of that effort and work, the reality is that this is not the withdrawal agreement. And the withdrawal agreement will make it very clear that should we, even under these terms, uh, struggle with a negotiation for a free trade arrangement and not complete that process, we will fall into the Northern Ireland backstop as it exists at the moment. And that will mean simply that we will be bound by those uh, restrictions that force Northern Ireland into a separate arrangement and us into the customs union. And I simply say to my right honourable friend, therefore, I would hope that she would now consider that none of this is at all workable unless we get the withdrawal agreement now amended so that any arrangements we make strip out that backstop and leave us with that positive open border that we talked about.